we're counting on you. Consider my friend, Kabok. Why? He and a group of traitors tried to take the ship. Kabok is the only survivor. There is also evidence that Kabok sent a coded message to Federation space. I do not understand why a warrior I have trusted with my life would do this. He tried to explain. I do not need to listen to the words of a traitor. Rot in the break! Ambassador Babat has ordered me to bring him to the Amaga system for questioning. Kabok will die screaming. It is not an honorable death, but it is the one Kabok deserves!
do what you think is best. It's risky, but Kvalk may be our best chance to stop Bavat and this planet killer. I'm notifying all available ships to change course for Imaga. Once the energy drain is taken care of, they'll move in to support you. I don't need to tell you how important it is to stop the Doomsday Machine before Bavat can use it to attack populated worlds. Millions of people are relying on you to save them. I know you can do it. Good luck. Yes, Captain? Understood. I'll join you shortly. We're counting on you. Here. I think I have a solution to our problem. We need to land on the planet to take control of the energy drain, but you would be noticed instantly. I've replicated a hollow emitter used by our intelligence services. It will change your appearance and voice to that of a Klingon warrior. I have enough devices for you and a small weight. Go ahead, try it out. Kapla! Leave the hollow emitter on for now. Get used to it. Benzil to boarding parties. The captain is using a holographic disguise. If you see a Klingon moving toward the bridge, do not fire. Repeat, do not fire. Questions?
minimal damage, Captain. All systems are functional. Drones? Ah! Bavat must have upgraded the security. Scanning the generators now. I have the data. We will need to load the control program into all three generators. After that, we can change the command codes from a terminal on the planet's surface. The objective here is simple. Find a control console and change the command codes. Then Bavat won't be able to stop us from shutting down the energy drain. There are two consoles. The Alpha console is staffed by an officer who might be willing to negotiate. The Beta console, uh, let's just say that Commander Talk prefers fighting to talking. The soldiers here shouldn't challenge you. But be careful of the TARs. The hollow emitters won't fool them. 
I have another task to complete. Meet me back here when you are done with the command codes.
vampire would... Yes, sir. Come on! Testing grounds. The Doomsday Machine will destroy them. It will create glorious, endless war and strife. And it is all possible because of you. Your naivete has been a great help to me. Thank you. No! I will not allow you to dishonor the Empire with your thirst for blood! We face our enemies as warriors, Bogvat! We do not massacre innocents with machines of death! There are no innocents! There are only the strong and the weak! Are you strong enough to fight your own weapon? I have destroyed the device controlling the planet killer. No one is safe. This isn't over! Warriors, attack! Joel, eat you! Structural integrity holding, sir. We're shook up, but we'll be okay. Captain, there's an unauthorized shuttle launch. It's... it's Kavok. Hail coming in, sir. I'll put it on the main screen. Stay where you are, Captain. I'll handle this. Kavok, turn that shuttle around! You'll be killed! My life is of no consequence. But my honor. No, I must do this. Destroying this abomination is the only way to redeem myself. 
Farewell, Captain. Koi Kalis Pook Blood. Koi Pook Be Poo. Yakbo Matbo She Shubui. Se Machu Me Poo. Mashu Managich Bako Chu. Nipe Yin Majak Wolf. Ku. Van Ma Hefej En Shok Teach Tak. Van Puma Di Pupare. Mashu Tak. Kuma Me Puma Shu Ta. Ma. significant damage to the doomsday machine, sir. But it's still active. Captain, we still have the Harpang torpedoes. They might be enough to finish the job. The machine's hull is solid neutronium, so targeting it won't help. We'll need to fly in front of the doomsday machine and launch the torpedoes down that thing's throat. The fleet will be here to help distract it, but we need to be careful. If we're in front of it when it fires its anti-proton beam, we won't fare any better than that moon did. 